We begin tonight with accusations of elder abuse out of Birmingham with one man facing charges. Thank you so much for joining us at 10. I'm Amira David. Court documents say neighbors had heard knocking and moaning through the shared wall for over a year. And this summer, the sounds became more urgent. So neighbors called the police saying they feared the man was being held in the basement against his will. Tonight, 7 Action News reporter Sarah Grimmer joins us from the home where this happened and has more on what police found inside. With the sound of motors from Woodward Avenue right next door, it may be hard for someone walking by to hear the continuous knocking that police reports say was coming from this home's basement. I spoke to neighbors who told me they'd never expect it. Uh, it's kind of surreal. This case report obtained by 7 Action News states what neighbors in this Birmingham neighborhood would never expect. That next door, an 83-year-old man spent 15 hours of his days locked in a basement without access to water or restroom. It's pretty scary and surprising at the same time. The report states that the older man lived in this unit of this duplex for about a year and a half and that neighbors that shared a wall could hear him knocking and murmuring, I'm inside for about 20 minutes every day. On July 14th, documents say those neighbors heard him aggressively knocking for two hours and called police. I've been here since 2018 and it's a pretty quiet, happy, family friendly neighborhood. Documents say when police yelled into the home, a faint male voice called back that he wanted to be let out. Officers entered the home and found a bucket of sand blocking the door to the basement. The door was also locked with a deadbolt. Once behind the door, Police found this security camera pointing down to the basement and these light switches covered by a clear plastic box and locked. At the bottom of the stairs, police found the elderly man. Officers stated that it was clear he was dealing with memory issues. The room smelled strongly of urine and, as you can see, there were no windows, no access to running water. The bed had multiple ripped black garbage bags being used as a sheet. There should be consequences. Here's a picture of police escorting the elderly gentleman out of the home. In September, this man, 27-year-old Darius Toddy, was charged with vulnerable adult abuse in the fourth degree. Police say the elderly man's wife had turned his care over to her pastor, Reverend Daryl Toddy, and Darius Toddy is a reverend's son. Darius told officers he would leave the home in the morning and return in the evening. He said the camera and deadbolts were for safety measures and that the elderly gentleman was in good health. The elderly man is now at an adult care facility in Redford Township. Everybody just looks very normal and happy and, uh, you know, they go about their day as if nothing is happening while somebody's locked in their basement. And the prosecution stated they do intend to add a felony charge against Darius Toddy. He's due back in court for a pretrial on October 25th. Reporting in Birmingham, Sarah Grimmer, 7 Action News.